The victim at the center of the St. Paul School rape case reveals her identity and how she's doing two years after her ordeal. And even when I get my panic attacks and I lock myself in my closet because I don't want my little sister to see me like that, and she comes into my room sometimes and she'll she'll come into my closet when I'm rocking on the floor and punching my legs, trying to get myself to calm down. Chessie Prout was 15 years old when she says Owen Labrie, a former fellow student at the prestigious prep school, sexually assaulted her as part of a ritual called Senior Salute, in which seniors try to have sex with younger students before they graduate. Chessie's identity was kept private through her three days of testimony at Labrie's trial, but says it's important to speak out now in hopes of helping others. She says she is disappointed with Labrie being convicted on misdemeanor sexual assault charges and not felony charges. They said that they didn't believe that he did it knowingly. And that frustrated me a lot because he definitely did do it knowingly. The Prout family is also suing St. Paul's school for failing to protect their daughter. The school released a statement that reads in part, we categorically deny that there ever existed at the school a culture or tradition of sexual assault. However, there is no denying the survivor's experience caused us to look anew at the culture and environment. Chessie is also working with a nonprofit called Promoting Awareness Victim Empowerment, which works to prevent sexual violence through social advocacy. I just can't imagine how scary it is for other people to have to do this alone, and I don't want anybody else to be alone anymore. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Mara Montalbano.